Welcome, my friends, to day five, a successful mind. Lydia Child says, belief in oneself is one of the most important bricks in building any successful venture. Our meditation today is on making your mind an ally in your success. Just as we learned how befriending the body supports us in manifesting success, your mind also plays an essential role in helping you pursue your worthy goals. Although everyone's mind has an almost limitless potential for creativity, inspiration, and insight, we tend to vastly underutilize our minds out of habit and lack of exercise. Fortunately, the mind is adaptable and can renew itself at any time. This flexibility is reflected in neuroscience research that tells us the functioning of the brain is capable of laying down new neural pathways as well as healing and regenerating new brain cells. All the brain requires is the directive of the mind. When your mind becomes your close ally, you can overcome self-defeating thought patterns and replace them with self-supporting thoughts, laying the foundation for meaningful success. By now, we all understand that our thoughts create our reality and what we think determines what shows up for us. Change the way you think and you change your life. That is true. Allow yourself thoughts that transcend the boundaries of what you think you know. Let your mind expand to embrace the challenging and new. Trust the thoughts that uplift you, bringing you fresh and inspired insights. There are treasures in our minds if we give ourselves the permission, time, and space to discover them. We are inviting success that knows no limits. Your mind is your powerful ally, serving in your success by inspiring you and bringing you insights. Most people underuse their minds for many reasons. They don't feel as smart as others. They place the mind on autopilot, employing their mental energy on routine and habits. They don't exercise their minds creatively and therefore mental functions begin to atrophy and weaken. The good news is that your brain physiology is structured to renew itself and create new pathways and behaviors for your entire life. The latest findings in neuroscience reinforce that the brain is capable of healing and renewal. It only needs new intentions and consistent feedback from the mind. There is every reason to make your mind an ally, not an obstacle. You can begin today a process of renewal that needs only some self-awareness on your part. The following behaviors apply to your life here and now. Notice any self-defeating thought and replace it immediately with a self-supporting thought. Ask for and expect better ideas. Have the patience to await a better idea. Give your mind new material to think about. Stop and say no to repetitive routine thinking. The purpose of these behaviors is to restore fresh thinking while avoiding old mental ruts. First, get in the habit of noticing when you have any thoughts that cause anxiety, discomfort, and any other form of self-defeat. Let's say you face a challenging situation and you think, I'm not good enough. Stop and make a choice to replace this thought immediately, being as rational as possible. Your substitute thought might look like any of the following. I am good enough. I know that. I have been successful at this before. Or, I don't know if I'm good or bad at this challenge, but I am willing to try and ask for help. Give yourself permission to have a thought that settles you 
makes you feel more confident and offers an alternative you can trust. Once you start to do this, your mind will open up and become your ally. Every problem created by the mind can be solved by the mind. Have patience with yourself because you are making a major shift. By deciding to accept your mind as an ally is immensely helpful in becoming a success. As we prepare to meditate together, let's take a moment and consider our centering thought. I gain insight and inspiration from my mind. Now let's prepare for our meditation. Find your space, your preferred meditation tool, and please begin to become aware of your breath and just breathe slowly and deeply. With each breath, allow yourself to become more deeply relaxed and then gently introduce this mantra. I open my consciousness to reality. This mantra clears and simplifies the mind. As you repeat the mantra, visualize your mind becoming as pure and still as a crystal clear lake. Repeat it quietly to yourself. I open my consciousness to reality. With each repetition, feel your body, mind, and spirit open and receive just a little more. Anytime you find yourself distracted or pulled away with other thoughts, simply return your attention to your breath and continue repeating the mantra. I open my consciousness to reality. Take as much time as you need and when you feel ready, release the mantra by repeating it out loud three more times with three more deep breaths. I open my consciousness to reality. Please be sure to record and journal about your experience. I open my consciousness to reality. Namaste.